Let's talk a little bit about these next problems. What are the directions there? Consider each set of angles for each circle, I mean for each circle the largest angle, and explain your choice. Oh, I can do this. Okay, so take a minute. I, like to I, already, I already know this. Talk to me about the first one. I already know this. This is it. Do, just circle this. Okay, why is that larger? Okay, as it go, this is... If you look at this of a circle, like... And then I guess I could do it. And that's already part of it, so yeah. This is the part of the circle. So, I'll just say that's x degrees. But this is the other degrees angle. And this is more more obtuse, but they're both acute, but this one is closer to the 90 degree angle. What is closer to the 90 degree? This angle is closer, so I'm going to guess this is 45 degrees. That's an angle. Why would you guess that? Because this is 90. I mean, like, the straight lines are 90, and then it's like halfway in between both of these. And gotcha. Half of four, 90 divided by 2 is 45. So I'm going to it's about forty-five. It's an estimation. What about the What about the one on the left? This is probably like the one over there. So it's half of the half. So ninety divided by four is. It's like shoot. Ninety divided. You think that's about ninety divided by four degrees? No, wait. This is the third of 90. This is 30 degrees. Okay. Well, because look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, that's 30 degrees. Why is that? A clock has 12 rotations. I don't know what you mean by 12 rotations. I don't know, like... Here's the 12, here's the 11, the 10, the, the 1, the 2, the 3. Each of these is 5, 12, no, 90 divided by 12. Wait. Each one of these is 30, 30 degrees. Why? Because... I am looking. I mean, I guess it's the same thing, but whatever. 90 degrees. So why would each of those wedges be 30? Because there's 90 degrees. Okay. If you take this, that is in between both of these. So, yeah. That's in between both of... That's in between both this line and this line. Go. I'm still not clear why the wedge is 30 degrees. Here's one piece. You're only focusing on this piece. Okay. And then that's one piece. That's two pieces. That's three pieces. This is only one out of the three pieces. That's okay. a third. And if you take a third of a whole number, that would be one divided by three. So you take the whole number and divide it in three pieces. So and 90 divided by 3, which is a right angle, and you divide it into that one out of the three pieces, that one out of the three pieces would be 30 degrees. Gotcha. So, yeah, this is... Sorry, I did all that work. No, I, I agree. I agree. So, so, X is uh, 30 degrees. Gotcha. That's 45, that's 30. So, that's bigger. 